each listing should be associated with a product from stock. It can be a warehouse of a connected store, a warehouse, or a Baselinker warehouse. Let's move on to the ongoing offers. In addition, the advanced search engine allows us to filter out offers after a warning. That is an auction not connected to the item from the storage. Let's set such a filter. In the list of offers, in the information column, we have an additional no association icon. Let's move on to the details of the auction. In the Associations tab, we have information that there is no such association. We can make this linkage directly from the card or by selecting the auctions in bulk and performing the associate with the product from the storage operation. We choose the storage with which we want to associate the products. In our case, let it be the Baselinker Academy Inventory. We click Execute. In this case, we have the entire association wizard. We can enter the ID number, variant ID. We can use the inclusion of product hints and search for the product manually in our storage. As you can see, we have the ID number on the right and the product name on the left. In addition, we can adjust the offer automatically. We can do it by EAN number, SKU number, or name. When matching by name, as you can see, our product has been associated. However, it should be remembered that the matching applies only to the main product. In the case of variants, it must be selected manually. We can also load associations from a file. Our file should have the format shown here in the information. From this perspective, we can also download files with associations. Then we will generate a CSV file with the associations that are visible on the screen. We save the associations. We click Return to the Auctions list. We are removing our filter due to the fact that after such a filter, no auction was found. We set the filter. As you can see, our auction is already associated with the product from the warehouse. However, there is another error message. It says that quantity in storage is lower than the quantity of product in the auction. Let's fix that. Let's use the Edit button and go to Associating tab. If the EAN number, SKU number, and weight or VAT rate are changed in the associated product, they should always be refreshed as the system will remember the information that was before the association. We can refresh the data from the storage or associate with another product. We're closing. We can also refresh the connections in bulk. We mark auctions and perform the associate with products from the storage operation. We choose our storage, we choose execute, and just save the associations. This operation is the same if we refresh the details of the auction.